Mas here. So today we are here to do another round of gachas. Today I am going to do Super Mario gachas right here. These are some of the figures that you can get. There are four different ones that you can collect. These are a little pricey though. The other gachas were about $2 per spin, but these are about $3 per spin. It's probably because the figures are a little more of higher quality. We are going to spin it four times and hopefully I get all four different kinds, but if, if I get the holes, I think I'll be still be happy. So let's get started. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Oh, mutsuke. Oh, one good Oh. So I got this black ball. Here's my second one. Two, three. Four, five, six. Second one, we got a yellow ball. One, two, uh, three, four, five, six. Six. Oh, another yellow. Well, last one. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh. Oh. Red ball. Hi guys, last secure. So if you guys noticed already, the clips that I inserted previously in the beginning of this video was actually filmed while I was in Korea. I actually got these four capsules, Gatapon capsules, when I was in Korea, but because you kind of have to assemble them, I didn't want to sit down on the ground in the middle of the crowd and do it. So I just asked my friend Jeromi to film the first part, and I brought these capsules with me to the United States. And I'm going to open them with you guys! Yay! So we're going to open these one by one even though you can kind of tell that these two capsules are going to be the same because you guys can kind of see the same like part sticking out, right? Eh. Anyway, we're going to act like we're surprised. I, I bet they're going to look cute anyway. The first capsule we're going to open is going to be this gray capsule. And there's a tape right here. Ooh, that was actually easy to take off and I'm going to just stick it right here and I will throw it away later. Let's see which figure I got inside. So these are supposed to be all Super Mario's and I believe there are supposed to be like four different ones for you to collect. Oh my gosh, open please. Oh, is there another piece of tape? No. Okay, plastic, you can do it. Guys, I'm telling you, I'm not this week. Oh, see? Ooh, <gasps> who is it? Oh, let me just show you the little flyer that came inside. So these are the characters you can collect. I actually played Mario when I was young, but not to the point I had to defeat, defeat this villain. I would always die within like the first minute or two. I was horrible with the game. So if I got this character's name wrong, you do let me know. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. This is actually the little, little one. This is not the fully grown up villain, but it's the little junior one, little baby. <gasps> How cute. Super, super, super adorable. Oh my gosh, I am loving this. Very nicely detailed and the paint job is actually pretty well done. And right here we have a little base and a little stick. So let's assemble these together. Also good, not much um, assembling. I thought I would have to like play a little puzzle game or something like that with this um, gacha, but nope, I don't have to. So I just insert the rod in to the base. Ta-da! Isn't that awesome? Okay, okay, so that's good. Let's get to the second ball, which is this yellow one. Take the tape off. <laughs> now I'm having trouble taking the tape off. Okay, and this little label. Must be broken. 
Okay. Okay. Oh, guys, I'm telling you, this is actually harder than it looks. Oh, okay. There it goes. And, oh, looks like I got the caterpillar one. Same flyer. And here's the little figure I got. So here is the little caterpillar. I wonder if this one um, actually has a name. Really, really cute. Very nicely painted and very nicely sculpted as well. Very cute. And he came with a base also, but no rod. So I guess he goes right onto the base. This is actually quite difficult. Okay. Oh, one is small and one is actually big. So this one, the small one goes... Niho, get in there, get in there pegs, please. I actually didn't peg the front one all the way in, but I was afraid that, you know, I was going to break its leg. So yeah, still this one looks still awesome, right? Cute. So now on to this red one. Let's see who is in this red one. Open. Okay, I think if I squeeze it, oh, guys, I found an easy way to open these capsules. So you just, instead of trying to pull it up, you just squeeze it. I've learned. See, I can learn. Ooh, I got Super Mario. How awesome. Yay. Okay, so looks like there are two different pieces in this bag. Let's take Super Mario out. He looks so cute. Super Mario and Fire Flower. Here is Super Mario. He's so cute. Oh my goodness. I am loving these little figurines. And also here is the Fire Flower. And okay, so also this one did not come with a rod. So let's see if I can assemble this one together. Hopefully it's not as hard as um the caterpillar one. Okay, so that was quite easy. And then the fire flower can go in right in here. Yay, that was not hard at all. <gasps> How cool. Okay, so maybe I should do it this way. So that it looks like he's sniffing the flower. Awesome. Okay, so you can kind of guess who is in this one, right? Um, so we'll just open to make sure. <laughs> no. Am I having trouble with tape again? Uh, the struggle is real, guys. It's real. Okay, open. Break the seal. Open. It is the caterpillar. These are the three different ones I got. So the one that I'm missing is Princess Peach. But I'm okay with it. I'm pretty happy with the three that I got. I am especially in love with this one. Even though I don't know the name of this character. Uh, oh, oh, I think it's, um, is it Bowser? It's Bowser! Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, I got it, I got it! This is baby Bowser, right? Yes! I did it! I hope you guys enjoyed this quick video. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. Until next time, bye guys!